Hello everyone. If you've been thinking about starting a YouTube channel, you may be wondering, as I did when I started my channel, when is the best time to start a YouTube channel? In this video, I'm going to tell you the absolute best time to start a YouTube channel. But first, I'd like to tell you a little backstory. About four or five years ago, I decided to start a YouTube channel. I started out to do a weekly vlog about historical sites and areas of interest around my hometown, Jacksonville, Florida. So I posted a few random videos that no one watched. And after a while, I just quit. I lacked the commitment to follow through on what I had started. And there was so much I didn't know about YouTube. And I didn't have the ambition or the desire to learn. I started this channel in January of this year, and this is my 12th video. And I'm just beginning to understand how much work is involved in starting and growing a YouTube channel. Being a one person operation, you're in charge of lighting, sound, and editing videos. And of course, there's that time it takes to get comfortable being alone in front of a camera. But the most important and challenging job is to consistently produce quality content that gives value to your viewing audience. Sometimes I wonder where I would be if I had stuck with it that first time I started a YouTube channel four or five years ago. I think my channel would be in a lot better place with four or five years experience under my belt than it is now. Sometimes I want to ask myself, Self, what were you thinking? Well, by now you may have figured out that the best time to start your YouTube channel is uh, now, today. The sooner you start, the sooner you can begin to shorten the learning curve. Listen, I'm no YouTube guru. I'm just a beginner, just like you'll be when you start your YouTube channel. But I took the plunge back in January, and I'm glad that I did. Don't follow my example and wait five years to start your YouTube channel. Start it today, even if it means just taking one little step toward making that first video. I made all the excuses you may be making. I need a better camera. I need more lights. I need a better microphone. I don't have a good space. I watched all the successful YouTubers with thousands of followers. I did everything but take action. I was overthinking it. You may think you need a new camera, but chances are you have one of these. And most modern day cell phones are capable of very high quality video, including 4K and 1080p. I'm going to leave links below in the description for some basic items that you could use to start making your videos right away with your smartphone. As for learning, there is a vast amount of videos on how to start a YouTube channel by people that are a lot more experienced than I am. In fact, these are people that I've learned a lot from and continue to learn from. These are just a few of the channels that I've learned from. Think Media, Brian Johnson, Nick Nimmin, and Katherine Manning, whose channel is called The Content Bug. Don't think your first videos have to be perfect. Chances are they're probably going to suck. I know mine did. Just keep growing and learning as you go. Well, that's all for this video. I hope this video gave you some inspiration to get started on your YouTube channel. And if you got value from this video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Stay safe, everyone. We'll see you in the next video.